Keep, I think that the wheels keep getting taller on me here. So, Camden, tell me a little bit of your background, how you got involved in racing these. Yeah, so I've actually been racing for about 14 years now, but I've been in Monster Jam. This is going into my fourth year, but this is the second year of Bakugan Dragon. It's a brand new truck last year. We actually came here in San Diego. Last year didn't well, turn out too good, so we're not going to talk about that one. But, <laughs> no, I've been racing for a long time, been very fortunate. I have had a whole lot of fun. Oh, my gosh. This is awesome. Tell me a little bit about your rig here and why you like it so much. Yeah, so Bakugan Dragonoid is actually based off of the card game and animated show on Netflix. Uh, it, it's such a really cool and awesome brand. Spin Master came in and said, you know, we are relaunching the Bakugan brand. We want to make it out of a Monster Jam truck. And it's so cool with the, the wings and the horn. It, it's so amazing to see flying high through the sky. I would imagine that you get a lot of cheers and you get a lot of uh, younger fans, I would think, too. Tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, the, well, the best part about Monster Jam is that we actually have a pit party that is before the event where the fans get to come out uh, come out see the trucks see the drivers take pictures sign autographs it's a whole lot of fun uh, but you know I've always wanted to be a Monster Jam driver and to have kids come up to you and say that you they want to be one too and say you know you never give up because I was you too yeah. but it's just so amazing to be able to have that experience talk a little bit I mean so it you you have to like wiggle way up and in there to get in there what is it like when you're in the truck yeah, it's a little bit of a jungle gym to get up actually in there but right underneath actually on the other side you would climb up from underneath and uh, we have a full custom suit from ISP seats fully custom to me. We have fire suits and everything, uh, but the really cool part is that we have rear steer in the truck. So we actually steer both the front and the rear tires up really? there. So there's a lot going on. Wow. So it's not just like jumping in a car and driving. It's not like that. Well, now it is for me, yeah. <laughs> but yes, yes. No, it, it definitely is totally different. We have 1500 horsepower in these 12,000 pound trucks. There's a whole lot going on. We're jumping these things 30, 40, 50 feet in the air, doing backflips, so many crazy things. If you've never been at the Monster Jam event, you have to come out. Is there any time that you get nervous or do, or do you just go for it do you do you just relish in that adrenaline rush i, I relish in it. i love it is it this is what i eat sleep and breathe yeah that is so awesome and obviously are you always working on new tricks are you always trying to come up with new things that you can do out there yeah we're always trying to kind of think of new innovative things i mean we're doing really incredible things now i mean like i said we're doing backflips we're doing moonwalks in these trucks i mean we're standing a 12,000 pound truck up on his front tires and balancing it it's incredible things to see especially in person but we're always trying to innovate yeah, always. I would imagine it's, it's the dream job, what you always imagine doing. Any advice for some of the kids? Never, ever give up. I was you one day. I was sitting on the couch watching Monster Jam, watching the 12-time World Finals champion that I am competing against, Tom Mentz, this weekend. I grew up watching him on TV. And here I am. So never, ever give up. If you dream big enough, you can absolutely make anything possible. Oh, that is so cool. There you go. Lauren, I'm going to send it over to you. Some good advice for maybe if Weston wants to become a Monster Jam <laughs> driver. There you go. Well, you never know. I mean, right now, I, I, I think that's a good probability. <laughs> All right. Looks like a lot of fun, Allie, uh, and a great venue to see it at. So I know a lot of people are going to be excited yeah. starting this weekend. Thanks, Allie.